Rich Arisko, say when he no be ogi amir. Chief Sani Nigi, na him talk this one. Say me Governor Baseki shabali come deliver him promise to support Benin Royal Museum. Chief Sani Nigi for Benin Kingdom for the seven local government for Edosa don't do one talk talk on Thursday for Benin City. Chief Sami be we be the yase of Benin Kingdom we yan on their behalf come yan say Benin people for us and Obodo Ibo no dey happy at all. I said those state government don't withdraw the criminal case against Rich Arisko say we get and one other. Say the government no do proper consultation with Oba of Benin Palace before they withdraw the case. The contact so say we gain up your game and he no get any right to claim the title sake of in relationship with your game family now from your mama's side. This conference is called by the chiefs and the Niki of Benin Kingdom of the seven local government areas of Edo State, namely Oedo, Ipubaoka, Eko, Ovia Northeast, Ovia Southwest, Orion, Kire, Umude. The recent publications from the Office of Edo State Attorney General and Commissioner of, for Justice with regard to the Edo State withdrawal of the criminal case against one Arisco Asemegi and one other necessitated this press conference. We would have responded long before now, but restrained for reason of contempt of court. Now that the case has been withdrawn, we decided to address the general public through this press conference. The Beninese, both at home and abroad, have been very angry over the withdrawal of the criminal case against the said rich Aristo Osemige and one other. We want to hereby state categorically that the said Mr. Arisko Osemege is not the Ogyame. He has no locus to claim or be addressed as Ogyame. Neither has he any right to the title Ogyame of Benin Kingdom. We are told that his relationship with the Ogyamian family is material, is, Im, is maternal, and not paternal. Hence, he has no right to or say in the Ogyamian chieftaincy title. What is being said here is that he has no right whatsoever, and he has no, there is nothing connecting him with the Ogyamia title. He cannot take that title because he is not the first son of the late Ogyamia. The Ogyamia is reserved for the first son of a rainy Ogyamia. He is not even an Ogyamia's son, so he has no business whatsoever with the Ogyamia. We, the Beni chiefs and Enige, are very much aware of Chief Osarobu Ogyamia, the Ogyamia of Beni Kingdom. He is a member of the Uzama Nibia at the Oba of Beni Palace. Chief Osarobu Ogyamia is the existing Ogyamia of Beni Kingdom because the family of Ogyamia has not informed the palace of his demise. As a matter of fact, we, we don't know about his demise. As far as we are concerned, he is li alive and kicking. However, the press statement by the Office of the Edo State Attorney General and Commissioner of, for Justice, which appeared in the Vanguard newspapers of Tuesday, 21st June 2022, um, other, among other newspapers, in connection with the withdrawal of the criminal case against Mr. Rich Aristko or Seneke and one other has empowered us to speak on the issue since there is no longer any case in court. 
the Benin chiefs and the Nige note that there was no proper consultation with the Oba of Benin before the withdrawal of the criminal case. Nevertheless, the said press statement by the Edo State Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice re-emphasized that the paramount traditional ruler in the seven local government areas of Edo State are first said, or rather are first listed, is our revered monarch, His Royal Majesty Omonoba Nedu Ukua Ulopola, Obaewari, the Oba of Benin. The press statement by the Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice stressed and enlightened that it is the Royal Majesty's prerogative to appoint and exercise authority over the chieftaincy title within his Royal Majesty's kingdom, howsoever the chief may, may be called or described. We, the Bini chiefs and the Nige, would like to reiterate that the said Mr. Rich Arisco Osenege and one other committed a sacrilegious offense against the Benin custom and traditions and have been adjudged enemies of the Benin palace and the Benin people in general. The Edo state government has withdrawn the said criminal charges against Mr. Rich Arisko Oseweke. But after due consideration, we hereby demand that Mr. Arisko Osemege should tender unreserved apology to the Benin people in at least three national newspapers and pledge his unalloyed loyalty to our only and ind ind indivisible Benin throne, which is the Oba of Benin. This apology should be made within reasonable time. Oba at Okberi. The chiefs and Inige Kontok say they won't remind the trusted governor Godin Obaseki for the promise when he made for November 2018 when he did present the 2019 budget say in government don't keep 500 million naira to support the development and construction of Bini Royal Museum. We are very happy and delighted over the re return of the Benin artifacts taken away in 1897 following the Benin invasion by the British soldiers. We like to use this opportunity to express gratitude to His Excellency, the President and Commander-in-Chief of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Muhammadu Buhari, GCFR, for the commitment in ensuring that Benin artifacts domiciled in the various foreign countries are returned to their original home and abode, which is the Oba of Benin's Palace. We are most grateful to the President, especially the National Commission for Museums and Monuments, and all those who have contributed in one way or another. We equally wish to remind the state government of his pledge to support the Benin Royal Museum in the Governor's 2019 budget to the State House of Assembly in November 2018 to fulfill our commitment towards making adult capital culture of the West of West Africa. We have earmarked 500 million Naira in the 2019 budget 
to commence the development and construction of the Benin Real Museum. This will be done in collaboration with the Palace of the Royal Majesty, Omonobanedu, Ukua Polo Polo, Ugidiga, Ewai the second of our Benin. We hereby request the Edo State Governor to live up to his promise by supporting the construction of the Benin Royal Museum instead of building another for which a part of the Benin Specialist Hospital have been demolished. Ebu Sereme, Obinome, TMC TV News.